Hi, I'm Dr. Elizabeth Welch, the medical director here at Stanford Animals, and we are presenting CATS prevention and flea control for intestinal parasites as well as fleas in our spay neuter suite. A reason to prevent your animals from getting fleas and ticks is because fleas carry tapeworms and cats can get tapeworms from ingesting a flea just as well as dogs can get tapeworms from ingesting a flea. These tapeworms you can note as little rice grains or some people call them cucumber seeds um, coming out of the rectum which is nobody wants that. So everyone probably knows what an adult flea looks like. Um, little black things with legs and they jump everywhere and sometimes you'll see them on your ankles or on your arms. Um, they can bite humans too, but thankfully fleas don't spread terrible things to humans nowadays. They were the plague back in the day, but that's been eradicated, so yay. Um, but you will notice these, um, you can see little almost like pepper grains on your, on your dog or your cat. And this is actually feces from the flea sucking the blood of your cat. So if you put those little black flakes under water, they will ooze red stuff. So that's how you can just can figure out if it's dirt versus flea dirt and uh, get your animals taken care of with your monthly or every three months or your Seresto that takes care of eight months worth of prevention. So ticks are a lot harder to find unless they have actually attached themselves to the cat and started sucking blood. So you'll see an engorged tick. Um, you'll be able to see those. A lot of your little baby ticks you're never going to be able to see. The good thing about treating and preventing ticks is that they do have infectious diseases. They can cause a whole lot of series of issues in your cat and your dog. So we wanna make sure that we don't get those because if those cats bring those ticks in, humans are also susceptible to these diseases. There are a couple of options for cats because cats, no matter if they're indoor or outdoor, can come down with flea infestations. Fleas are very resilient. They can come through your open windows, your open doors, it's nice nice and warm outside right now so spring fleas are in full effect so for your kitty cats that um, like to go indoor outdoor and might be a little sensitive to some topical um, medication we have a Seresto collar the nice part about the Seresto collar is it does last for eight months which is really nice it also protects against all um, life cycles of the flea and the tick so it's very nice. Uh, we sell those here at Charlotte. And again, there's a ton of products out there. These are the products that we currently carry within our facility. Um, there's also a topical medication called Brevecto. This one's really nice, one, because it's approved by, the only approved product by the FDA for flea and tick prevention in cats and dogs. It also is a topical, which is nice for cats, but the really nice thing is you only have to apply it every three months. And it does the entire life cycle of fleas and ticks as well. We have a third option, which is called Advantage Multi. And this is multi because it does a whole bunch of things. Not only does it take care of fleas, it takes care of one species of tick, but it also takes care of intestinal parasites and heartworms, which can be spread by mosquitoes in your kitty cats. We will discuss this more in a later episode because cats can get heartworms too. Thank you so much for joining us today for the Stand for Animals snippet. Please be sure to tune in for more by subscribing.